Hi, everybody. Reese Davis with you, bringing you the EA Sports NCAA Football 14 pregame show presented by Nissan. Innovation that excites. Neutral side action, and we're just about set to kick off. And they've got that huge offensive line, and, you know, you get too worried about them, and sometimes you can overlook the fact they can throw the ball. It's going to be tough today for this defense. I think they're going to have to take some chances and load this line of scrimmage. And, you know, as a play caller for this offense, when you have such a gifted running back, it opens up every aspect of the offense. I mean, the play-action pass with this running game, you get those linebackers and safeties coming up close to the line of scrimmage. It's a great time to really open up and show what you can do as a complete offense. It'll be a challenge. the ground with a tailback he's pushed out of bounds right around the 44 yard line Henry gets eight yards on the play it's second down now they're just a few feet away from that first down marker Gets rid of it quickly, and that was almost picked. The defense really missed a golden opportunity there. That's what separates a good player from a great player. When you have a chance like that, you need to take advantage of it. Tackle after a decent pickup. First down. From midfield, it's first down. Complete and he's hit hard. Number 47 on the tackle with the 46 yard line. That makes it second and six. Check tight right, tight right, tight right. Go oh, out there, check the house out there. They gonna need some therapy out here. Hands it off on the delay. Tackle after a decent run up the gut. And that's their third first down of the drive. The defense needs to figure out a way to stop them, or else they're gonna have no problem putting points on the board. From the 39-yard line, first down. He makes his way to about the 28. Maybe after a nice run like that, you try to go up in the air for the play-action pass. And this is the eighth play of the drive. Got it. And he goes down quickly. Six yards. That'll make it second and four. Second down, four yards to go. Ball on the 22. Wide open. Oh, he dropped it. They tried to fool him by running the same play again. Well, fooled no one there, Brad. This is the tenth play of this drive. there before he stepped out of bounds. Quarterbacks just love this scenario. He had his man one-on-one -on, -one on a corner route versus man coverage, and you just saw it. It results in an easy first down. Big opportunity to score here inside the five. It's first down and goal. Ball on the four. Touchdown, Crimson Tide. He hits the PAT. Let's check in with Reese Davis in the studio. Time to take you out to South Bend. This game was so tight, every play seemed to be of the utmost importance. He just drills this one. And it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. The quarterback leads the team out on the field for the first drive. That's a great tackle at the 36-yard line. And he has a huge run. I'll tell you right now, this guy is arguably one of the fastest players in college football today. There you see him turn it upfield with such fluidity and quickness. Nice 
run there. They get about four on that keeper. Gain of four on the play. That makes it second and six. Second down and six. Ball on the 40-yard line. And he's tackled at the 43-yard line. That'll bring up third and two. Makes it out to about the 43. That makes it first and ten. First and ten. Ball on the 43. And he's taken down around the 40-yard line. That's a gain of three on the play. That'll make it second and seven. Down at the 37. three on the play. Third down. And so it's another third down upcoming here. So the Badgers running back. He was injured earlier. You see him down there on the sideline, and it looks like he's ready to get back in the game. Got it complete. He's out of bounds. Game of 12 yards. First down. And this play is number eight on the drive. Four down, four down. Mike 19, Mike 19. Send it to the floor. They'll work the left side. And they get nice yardage on that run. That's a gain of four on the play. That makes it seven and six. From the 21-yard line. Second down. Inside the 10. He gets to about the 5. That makes it first and goal. 10th play of the drive. He's taken down at the 5. The running back gets a yard, maybe less. It's second and goal. Ball on the five. Touchdown, Badgers. That was a fantastic touchdown run by the halfback. This guy looks very impressive. When he has the ball in his hands, good things always seem to happen. The extra point to tie this game up. He makes the PAT. So an 11 play, 74 yard drive, and that's good for a touchdown. Brad, that's one of those drives that can just tear your heart out. They can really demoralize a defense when they drive the ball down the field, and a lot of the yards came on the ground. He's to the 20, and he just got stood up right there. Every drive is important in a tie game. I look for both sides to come out with some urgency. Give to the back and hit hard for a loss. That's a great play by the defense. There's nothing like a defense being able to slip off of a block, get into the backfield of the offense, and then make a play in the backfield to be able to create some momentum possibly for this defense. Around the 19-yard line. Gain of one on the play. That'll make it third and 13. From their own 19-yard line. Third down. The defender had it and then dropped it. Can't ask for much more than a three and out. Great job, defense. That'll bring up fourth and 13. 
And watch out, they're gonna bring the heat right here. He really got a hold of that one. And down he goes at the 45. I think this defense right now needs somebody to try to lift up their spirits. They seem to really be just out there kind of going through the motions. And I think the last time they were out there where they gave up such a long drive has had an impact and an effect negatively on the psyche of this defense. Myers out quickly to the tailback. First and 10, ball on the 44-yard line. They make the stop right around the 32-yard line. That's good for a game of 12 yards. That makes it first and 10. Three down, three down. Mike 19, Mike 19. Two and eight. They'll bring him down right around the 34. That is a loss of two yards. the 34 yard line second down pass complete and taken down immediately good for a gain of six yards that'll make it third and five man left man left Gets rid of it quickly. They can't connect. Incomplete. Well, the intended receiver on the play. Fourth down. They'll call on the field goal unit here for this long field goal attempt. Wisconsin is looking to go up by three. He gets it up, and he got it. This game's already shaping up to be a good one as we head to the second quarter. 10-7, Wisconsin. The Wisconsin Meyer gets set to kick this one away. He kicks it off, and he got all of that one. This one's going to be down in the end zone for a touchback. Welcome back. Tight game here in the second quarter as we begin play. Momentum swings have been fairly even. And with so little separation, this game can be drastically changed on just one or two plays. Heading for the corner. He's tackled at the 36. From their own 36-yard line. First down. Quickly to the tight end. Tackle made around the 47 yard line. On the delay, and he's brought down immediately. The defense just met the blockers head on and drove them back straight into the runner. It's second down now, 13 to go. Ball on their own 44. Gets past the tackler. He gets out to about the 44-yard line. Quickly to the tight end, incomplete. How are the intended receiver on the play? That'll bring up fourth and one. He'll try to knock this punt down inside the 20. It's away, and it's a booming punt. This one will go into the end zone, and they'll bring it out to the 20. In a game that's this close, you can't afford to waste possessions. Wisconsin is up a field goal. Ready. Ready. Run, 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 run. And 
And down he goes at the 22. That's a gain of two on the play. That makes it second and eight. From their own 22-yard line. Second down. Gets to about the 24-yard line. Gain of two yards. That'll bring up third and six. catch on that one and he's tackled at the 34 that makes it first and 10 first down 10 to go ball on their own 34 nice run up the middle Clements picks up about four yards on the play that makes it second and six Makes it out to maybe the 40-yard line. He gains a couple of yards on a carry. That'll bring up third and four. They're about four yards away here on third down. Three down, three down. Mike 19, Mike 19. Quick throw. Brad, I just think this quarterback's got to do a much better job of being able to read that defense and make quicker decisions, and especially when the defense starts to get pressure, you've got to either get rid of that football or check it down or take off and run with it. Wisconsin is up by three. He puts it away, and it's a great kick. And he makes it out to about the 24-yard line. Henry's frustrated, quite frankly, right now. I mean, he's having a great game, and you can put up all the yards you want, and he's not getting in the end zone enough, and he's going to have to have some help from some of his teammates right now, and I think he's going to try to pump them up over there. And I can understand his frustration. As you said, Brad, I mean, he's playing well individually, but he's got to keep his cool and really show his composure here as far as trying to be a good leader for his teammates. One thing about being the guy, the star, uh, when you're having a great game and your teammates are struggling, the best thing you can do is try to pump them up and not tear them back down. Uh, so we'll find out what, really what kind of character he's made out of here in the second half. Gains his way to the 36-yard line. It's first and 10. Ball on the 36-yard line. hits him hard at the 44-yard line. Maybe after a nice run like that, you try to go up in the air with a play-action pass. He gets to about the 31-yard line. We've got a first and 10. Ball on the 31. They'll spread the field with five wide. Quick out to his receiver. And he's taken down at about the 21. about three yards to get the first here on second down. Gets out to around the six. That makes it first and goal. And this is the eighth play of the drive. got it. Coaches don't like it when their quarterback gets hit like that. Don't be surprised to see the old coach get on his lineman to protect the quarterback a little bit better. From the 12-yard line, it's second down. 
Five wide. Fires it out, and they push him out around the four-yard line. That makes it and this is the tenth play of the drive. Going to the end zone, touchdown for the tight end. The tight end scored that time, and with authority. Brady's a physical football player, but he's also got the finesse to make a big impact in the passing game. And he hits the PAT. A 10-play, 75-yard drive, and they come away with a touchdown. So our score, 14-10. Alabama is lining up to kick this one off. He sends this one deep. And it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. I love the competitive spirit that we're seeing out on this field today. It looks like one team has the upper hand, and then the other comes right back in to be able to regain the lead. It's going to be an exciting finish. Momentum swings have been fairly even. And with so little separation, this game can be drastically changed on just one or two plays. The 50. Brought down at the 38. Let's see now how the defense responds to giving up the gain on the run. He's taken down at the 26. That's a game of 12 on the play. That makes it first and 10. Finds his man, first down, and he's immediately tackled. Good job here by the receiver to look the ball in and ensure he had possession. That's the right way to catch a pass. From the 14-yard line, first down. Takes it up the middle for a nice run. Wisconsin's going to have to use their second time out of the half. That brings up second and five. Brought down after a nice run up the middle. That's a game of six on the play. That makes it first and goal. It's first down. So inside the five with a first and goal. Tackle at the three yard line. Makes the tackle. No game. That brings up second and goal. Throws quickly into the end zone, caught for the touchdown. So the kicker will line up here and try to give his team a three-point lead with this extra point. He splits the uprights with the extra point. A seven-play, 75-yard drive, and the result, seven points. Brad, I thought that was a textbook drive. I thought they did a really good job of showing balance, mixing the play calling with the run and the pass. Just an overall well-executed touchdown drive. And so the score now, 17-14. Pretty good-looking touchdown drive the last time these guys were out there. Throws a bullet over the middle, and they make the stop at the 48. Alabama's going to take their first time out of the half. From the 48-yard line, first down. Concentration to haul it in. Alabama will have one timeout remaining. He 
gets rid of this one. The defense got some pressure and forced a bad pass. I think they've been a little bit more aggressive here with their pass rush, and that time it paid off with an incompletion. Second down, 10 yards to go. Ball on the 32. He lets it go. Intercepted. It's a good play when the corner can break up a pass, but it's even better when he can bring it in for an interception. First down, 10 yards to go. Ball on their own seven. Wisconsin holds a field goal lead. Fires out quickly to the tailback. They'll bring him down at the 14. Jones makes the tackle at the 14-yard line. That'll bring up second and three. A tight first half of football, and we head to the break. 17-14, Badgers. Welcome back, everybody. Second half action about to begin. And he got all of this one. Great kick. This one's going to be down in the end zone for a touchback. And here we go with the offense ready to get things going again. He's tackled around the 41 yard line. First and 10. Ball on the 41 yard line. Watch, watch number 86. Watch 86. Mike 19. Yeah. Motion, motion. Go, 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 go. Gets out to around the 48. Game of 11 on the play. That makes it first and 10. Two times, two times. He gets out to about the 37-yard line. Call it a gain of 11 yards. First down. First and 10. Ball on the 37-yard line. So the halfback loses about two on the run. Wisconsin has a three-point lead. Throws complete. He's got room to work. Very solid gain through the air. I'm impressed with the poise of this quarterback and the ability of the receiver to keep his concentration and get his hands on the football. They need about three yards to get the first down here on third down. That's a great tackle at the 29-yard line. The halfback picks up a yard. That brings up fourth and three. The kick is away. It's long enough, and he got it. Myers ready to kick. He just drills this one. They'll bring him down at the 19. This deficit can be easily overcome, sure. But they have to be thinking if they don't get something going on this series, the burden is going to be felt by their defense. He fights forward to about the 20. That brings up second and nine. We've got a second and nine here. Ball on the 20. Henry gets the carry. And they get nice yardage on that run. 
gain of seven yards. That'll bring up third and two. Looks like he flinched down there on the line. False start, offense. They'll give this one another try after the flag. And on third down, too. Third down. That's when you don't want those kind of things to happen. It's third down and seven yards to go. Ball on the 22-yard line. Ready! Quick pass, and he's right there to knock it away. Wasn't a bad pass at all, but just a good heads-up effort to get his fingertips on the ball. It looks like they're going to go after this punt. And this one is a beauty. Tackle made at the 43-yard line. He showed a good burst there. So now both teams come trotting back out onto the field. Wisconsin up six. He makes his way to about the 45. Game of 12 yards. First down. From the 45 yard line. First down. Again with the run. He's at the 30 to the 20. And he's tackled at about the 13. First and ten. And down he goes at the ten yard line. Gain of three on the play. That makes it second and eight. From the ten yard line. Second down. Touchdown, Badgers! And he tacks on the extra point. A four-play, 56-yard drive, and they get it in for seven. The score now, 27-14. Looks like they're ready for the kick. Excellent kick. And it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. There's got to be some sense of urgency to this offense right now. They don't have the luxury of wasting drives if they want to get back in the game. And off to the left. He's to the 40. Across midfield, and he's taken down around the 47-yard line. I thought it was pretty impressive they were able to stop it. I thought he had enough room to break away from everybody and take it all the way to the house. From the 47-yard line, it's first down. They go with a run, and he brought down in the backfield. Good job by the defense to overpower the offensive line and drop the back for a loss. Five guys will be out in the pattern as they're in the shotgun. What impresses me so much is the guy's vision. He read the coverage perfectly to find his man for good yardage. Third down, and they're going to need about three yards to pick up the first down. And he's tackled after positive yardage. Gives it right side. He's at the 20, the 10, and they push him out around the four yard line. First and goal from the four, looking for Pater. They put everyone up on the line. 
tackle made at the three. Personal foul. Face mask. Defense. And the defense gives up some free yards to the offense. Uh, you know, penalties can ruin a team's chances to win if they commit too many. It's first down, and they'll be looking for six points here. is left. Touchdown time. He's got two touchdowns on the ground today. Well, this young man is having a great individual day. But more of these guys on his team need to start doing the same if they want to get back into the game. And he converts the extra point. A six-play, 74-yard drive. And they add seven points to the scoreboard. And it was really those long runs that really helped propel that drive. Scott is lined up to kick this one off. Nice kick, plenty of distance. And it sails out of the end zone for a touchback. Man, both offenses here in this third quarter have been on fire. Time for the defense to step to the forefront a little bit. Makes you wonder which of these defenses has the ability to come up and make a stop. It could be one of those games where whichever defense comes up with that stop could be the team that wins the game. Makes it to the 41. Did you see how much space there was for that tailback up front? He better be thanking his offensive lineman for that. It's first and 10. Ball on their own 41. Wisconsin with a six-point lead. They run straight, brought down quickly. The lineman had a big push there to get in the backfield and bring him down. And once he gets moving, there's no stopping him. This guy is so big and strong that he's almost impossible to block with one guy. He's into the open field. He's at the 40. Inside the 30. He gets hit out of bounds. Right around the 14-yard line. First down. Let's see now how the defense responds to giving up the gain on the run. Nice play to set up first and goal. That's good for a gain of 13 yards. That makes it first and goal. And so they punch it in on the ground, Kirk Herbstreit. Great job up front by the offensive line. They get a good, strong push that allowed the runner to get it in there for the touchdown. And he adds the extra point. Meyer looks ready to kick this one off. He kicks it off, and he got all of that one. This one's going to be down to the end zone for a touchback. So their last drive resulted in six points. Do you think we'll see the same result on this one? They ran the ball extremely well on their last drive. And until this defense figures out how to stop it, I think they'll have no problem moving the ball down the field. Looks for the tight end, but they can't hook up. How will the intended receiver on the play? That makes it second and ten. From their own 25-yard line. Second down. He takes it right side for a good game. That'll make it 35. And he can't get away from the pressure. These special teams have done it before, blocking punts. It looks like they're coming after this one. He punts it away, and it's a great kick. 
He's knocked out of bounds at the 40-yard line. And for Clement, he's made an impression on this defense tonight. Why, he has, but let's also give some credit to the offensive line. Doing a tremendous job of pushing the defensive line back to give the running back some room to work with. And when you're an offensive coordinator and you have a back that's in this kind of zone, the most important thing for you to do, continue to give him the ball and continue to keep these drives alive because right now he is unstoppable. Run! They'll go ground. Tackles right around the 48-yard line. Gain of eight on the play. That makes it second and two. So with one quarter remaining, the Badgers in front, 34-21. Welcome back to the action here as we resume play here in quarter number four. Good outside run there. Pretty good gain on the play by the halfback. Good play here. Getting a new set of downs and keeping the run an integral part of this offense. From the 47-yard line. First down. He's taken down at the 46. That's a gain of one on the play. That makes it second and eight. Brought down at the 32-yard line. Already gained 14 yards. That makes it first and 10. From the 32-yard line. First down. Out of bounds around the 26-yard line. That's a gain of six on the play. That'll make it second and four. They'll bring him down at the 23. That's good for a game of three yards. That'll make it third and one. Short yardage situation here. It's third and one. They go to the ground and he stops short. No gain on the play. Fourth down. The kick is up, and he's got it. Everyone's all lined up and ready for the kickoff. And he got all of this one. Great kick. And it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. The offense will be hoping for a little more success than they had the last time out. Unstoppable today, 200 yards rushing. Sometimes guys will look a little rusty or not too sharp in the opening week, but he looks like he's got his rhythm today. We've got a first and 10, ball on the 36 yard line. Nice run up the middle. Henry comes away with five yards on the carry. That brings up second and five. Down of bounds at the 44 yard line. What a throw for a big game. That is a great example of the quarterback seeing the whole field and finding the guy who had the best chance of making a catch. First down, 10 yards to go. Ball on the 44. Ready. Takes the ball right. Tackled for a loss. Man, did he play that perfectly or what? As a linebacker, you have to be able to read the offense and make a quick diagnosis, which is exactly what he did on that play. Ready! Run, 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 run. 
Room around the corner. Nice gain as he works the right side. Henry gets seven yards on the play. So it's third down now, and they're going to need about four. Quick out to his receiver, and they make the stop at the 20-yard line. Second and six coming up here. Ball on the 16. They'll go with the run once again. He's tackled at the one yard line. That makes it first and goal. We're at play number nine of this current drive. The quarterback stays on the field as they try for the two-point conversion. They don't get it. Time for an update from the studio. Reese, what have you got? The Volunteers were ranked 22nd. Now they'll be lucky to hold on to a spot, any spot, in the poll. And for Kansas State, their season starts with a win. And down he goes at the 47-yard line. So the Badgers having everything going their way right now. They have put up 20 straight points on the board. Both teams are well aware that a score on this drive is going to create an almost insurmountable lead. This defense has really got to step it up and make a stop. Clements takes a pitch. He makes it out to maybe the 46-yard line. A one-yard gain by the halfback. That makes it second and eight. It's second down, eight to go. Ball on the 46-yard line. Just under three to go in regulation. And he's tackled at the 36-yard line. Called a gain of 10 yards. First down. Makes it out to about the 20. Alabama will take a timeout. That's their first of the half. First and 10. Ball on the 20-yard line. And down he goes. Around the 18-yard line. Alabama is going to have to use their second timeout of the half. Makes it to the 18-yard line. Alabama will take their final timeout. Third down, eight yards to go. Ball on the 18-yard line. The ball pops free. It's picked up, and he's taken down right around the 20. Kicks away, and it's good. Meyer ready to kick. He sends this one deep. This one's going to be down in the end zone for a touchback. Pretty good looking touchdown drive the last time these guys were out there. A little over a minute in the game. Hey, 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 hey. 
He's going to air it long. Tackle made right around the 28-yard line. Brad, I just think this quarterback's got to do a much better job of being able to read that defense and make quicker decisions. And especially when the defense starts to get pressure, you've got to either get rid of that football or check it down or take off and run with it. Big play, and it's first and goal. Getting the ball to your tight end and allowing him to make plays in the passing game can really open things up on the outside for your real speedster. That quickly incomplete. From the 10 yard line. Second down. Quarterback all by himself in the backfield with five wideouts. Fires in there, got it. Touchdown. Big pass play for the score, and we're down to a one score game. And he tacks on the extra point. So a five-play, 75-yard drive, and it's good for seven points. Brad, I thought the key to that drive really had a lot to do with the quarterback and the receivers getting in sync, making it very tough for the defense to slow him down. Brought down at the 42. Wisconsin's a team on a mission right now. Somehow, they have been able to put up 23 unanswered points. Late in the fourth quarter in a one-possession game, and poise is what it's all about here. Who's going to have it and who won't? And this should be a kneel down as they just try to kill the clock. Second down, about 12 yards to go. Ball on the 44-yard line. Wisconsin with a six-point lead. The quarterback takes a knee, and that's always a good sign if you're a fan of this team. Henry's stats today, again, are off the charts, and they continue to be all season long. Unfortunately, they don't get the win. Yeah, the team loses the game, but for him individually, he continues to show the nation why he's one of the best at his position.